Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Hien Farm Real Estate. My name is Hien and my mission is to bring you the most truthful information about real estate in Vietnam. Before we get started, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. You don't want to miss any information about real estate in Vietnam, do you? Today's topic is going to be about a very interesting, a massive plan by the government to change Ho Chi Minh City into a completely different look. And the expectation is to turn the whole area into the new Pudong of Ho Chi Minh City. So if this sounds interesting to you, keep watching. Housing prices in Tu Tim are currently trading at 20-30% to 30 lower than District 1, current CBD of Ho Chi Minh City. At present, in Shanghai, housing prices in Pudong are at least 40% higher than Pu Si, the current CBD. Over time, we expect similar trends will take place in Tu Tim. Tu Tim is the new financial center and new urban area of Ho Chi Minh City. It's considered as the largest urban complex in Southeast Asia in the coming years. Once completed, Tu Tim will continue to raising Ho Chi Minh City into the most modern metropolis, getting on the same level with Shanghai, Manila, Bangkok, and Jakarta. Over the past 30 years, Ho Chi Minh City has witnessed a tremendous growth. However, rapid growth faces many problems. Infrastructure in the central area is now beginning to overload under the pressure of rapid expansion. Traffic congestion has been steadily increasing in the past five years, with the number of cars increasing at least 35% every single year. The development plan of Tu Tim will reduce the pressure that the city center is dealing with. In addition, it contributes to preserving the historical value of the old center that used to be the pern of the Far East due to the limited demolition of old buildings and the redevelopment. Tu Tim has a total area of 657 hectares which is located opposite to the current CBD across the bank of the Saigon River. The whole area consists of 176 plots of land with approximately 3.2 million square meters of residential space and 3.4 million square meters of commercial space. Tu Tim will be home to 145,000 residents and 217,000 employees. This new financial center will be the base of a big number of corporate headquarters and will become a vibrant destination for residential, office, commercial centers, hotel and service apartments and all kinds of service. Admittedly, the development of Tu Tim new urban area has been slower than planned due to complex land compensation, unstable economic conditions, and budget deficits. However, with the pressure on the current CBD and the government's commitment to accelerate the completion of major infrastructure in Tu Tim, we believe that since the Sasaki's master plan announced more than 12 years ago, now the time is gone that investors should be faster than ever in the race to seek investment opportunities in Tu Tim. Eight zones of two team and their functions. Zone 1, located in the northern half of the central core area, which is a high density multifunctional commercial and service center. This is the location of important public and highlight works such as the Exhibition Convention Center with a pedestrian bridge over Canal 1 connecting to the museum. Symphony Hall and Planning Information Center 
traffic connections including pedestrian bridge connecting zone 1 and zone 2A to Nguyễn Huệ Walking Street in District 1. Thủ Thiên Bridge number 2 connecting zone 1 to Grand Marina Basan in the CBD District 1. The highlight residential project in Zone 1 is the Metropolitan Team by developer Sun Kim Land. Zone 2, including 2A, 2B and 2C. Zone 2 is a high density complex with commercial, residential and sports functions located in the south of the central core area. This functional area is divided into three small areas, Zone 2A in the north of the east-west boulevard, Zone 2B with the observation tower complex, and Zone C is the sport and entertainment complex. Some highlight public projects including observation tower complex, stadium, multi-purpose gymnasium, schools, and local administrative center. Traffic connection including pedestrian bridge connecting Zone 1 and Zone 2A to Nguyễn Huệ Walking Street in District 1. Two team tunnel connecting Zone 2 to CBD District 1. Spinal Main Road Mai Chi Tha. Metro Line Number 2. And Two team bridge number 3 connecting Zone 2B and 2C to District 4. Highlight residential project in Zone 2, including Eco Smart City by Lotte in Zone 2A and Empire City by Capoland in Zone 2B. Zone 3 Zone 3 is a mixed-use residential area located along the north side of Tu Team with schools and museum opposite to the convention and exhibition center via Canal 1, Green Park of 4 hectares right in front of Saigon River. Traffic connection including Tu Team Bridge number 1 connecting Zone 3 to CBD District 1 one of the most highlighted residential projects in Zone 3 is the River Tu Team by the Refico. Compared to Zone 1 and Zone 2 in which residential is mixed with offices and commercial centers having a more busy and crowded vibe, Zone 3 is more of a residential area with lower buildings, less construction density, therefore more quiet and less crowded. Zone 4 Zone 4 is a mixed-use, low-rise residential area located in the north of Tu Tin. The important highlight project includes schools, a community center, a local administration office, fire station, and fuel supply station. Zone 5 includes public works to the north of Mai Chi Tha Boulevard, residential area to the south of Mai Chi Tha, and multifunctional commercial buildings with key public works such as Children's Palace, Urban Administration Building, Fuel Supply Station, Two Schools, Community Center, and Local Administration. Zone 6 Located along Mai Chi Tha Boulevard and among the natural canals of Tu Tim, the software park is planned to be located north of Mai Chi Tha. This will be the focal point for economic activities and research in information technology. The approach is the International Hospital, which provides quick and easy access to the hospital from Mai Chi Tha or through the accesses inside and outside of Tu Tim. To the south of Mai Chi Tha is a functional area comprising 
mixed commercial plots located along the main corridor, behind which are quiet residential areas with lower densities. The entire area will accommodate public transport such as buses or internal bus routes and subway lines leading to the station located in the International Hospital and the Software Park. Zone 7 is two teams easternmost area, which includes residential complex in the east, currently under construction, forms the eastern gateway of two team. Buildings are being developed from medium to high floors with full infrastructure and public services. The South Delta Resort Hotel area combines harmony with the natural landscape of two team. The hotel area is specially designed to ensure maximum privacy as well as connection to the rest of the hall area. The marina complex has been proposed to be located at the crossroads of the Catre Lone Canal and the Saigon River. Yachts of all sizes will dock here. The port surrounding is expected to be a complex of commercial areas such as restaurants, shops and holiday huts. Zone 8 is the southern wetlands, the most diverse ecological development area in Tu Tim. Most of the area is mangroves, waterways are dredged. All the development projects in this area are to be very carefully considered and planned in order to conserve this very important part of the peninsula. When a tidal surge from the Saigon River pours into the canal system and the wetland area, the water will be filtered and dumped into the water navigation system. There are three development projects that have a great impact on this area. The Southern Delta Resort located in the west, Water Park and the Bonetical Research Complex. These projects are designed and managed with sustainability to ensure the steady development of the southern wetlands. So those are 8 zones of 2 team. Let's take a look at the whole 2 team area one more time. So, what do you think about Thu Tim New Urban Area? Do you think that it is potential? Do you believe in the future of the Pudong of Ho Chi Minh City? Please let me know in the comment section. If you think this video is helpful, please give it a like or share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this in the future. That will help me a lot. Thank you again for watching. This is Hin Farm Real Estate. I hope to see you around to Team The Pudong of Saigon. And see you soon.